today we're making whipped honey or cream honey or spun honey it's all the same thing honey that is whipped till fluffy and stick around because we'll be making two flavor variations as well so the trick to whipped honey is using crystallized honey the honey that has started to solidify because it's been sitting around you ever go in your cupboard and you find that honey jar that started to crystallize and you either microwave it or you toss it away thinking you can't use it well now you have a use for it and all we're gonna do is add our crystallized honey to a mixing bowl you want about a cup or more just so that it can whip really well and we're gonna whip it on a medium high speed for about 20 minutes i'm gonna show you every five minutes along the way so you can see as it progresses and when it's all done we're just going to pour it into different jars and we're going to store it in our pantry if you do live in a warmer climate, you can keep it in the fridge. It will prevent it from separating faster. It will go more solid in the fridge and you'll need to let it warm up before you use it. But all cream honey will eventually separate and all you have to do is re-whip it to get it back like this. So now that you know the basic recipe, let's make some fun flavors. You can also gift this. It would be a wonderful Christmas gift if you put it in a cute jar. So we're gonna do pumpkin spice first. We're gonna take one cup of our whipped honey and we're gonna add one teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice. Now, if you don't have pumpkin pie spice, we do have a recipe and I'll link it here so you can make your own at home. And you're just gonna whip it till it's incorporated and then we're gonna pour it into a jar. That one smells amazing. And the next one we're gonna make is chocolate whipped honey. This one is amazing. We're gonna add two tablespoons of cocoa powder. And again, we're just gonna whip it till it's incorporated. And we're gonna add that one to a jar. Now, how do you use whipped honey? So the easy answer is you can use it basically anywhere you would use normal honey. Most people like to spread it on toast or crackers, use it as a dip for fruit, drizzle it on cookies or marshmallows. You can spoon it into your coffee, tea, hot chocolate, warm milk, or put it into cute little jars and gift it to your friends and family. 